just some fun stuff, a little black book per se of how to use oils to spice up the bedroom, spice up your intimacy, with yourself, your partner, all the things. This is a zero judgment place, just so you know. So as you guys are popping in, feel free. I don't know if you guys can use it. Oh yeah, you can use the chat. So it looks like over here. Right. Looks like Courtney is linking in. Hi guys, feel free to use the chat. It's probably the easiest way for me to see questions. Um, for me to just see that you guys are here hanging out with me. So Courtney, I don't know where you're at. I'm try oh, there you are. You're under oil life. Okay. So I hope you guys are excited. Okay. It looks like we are recording. So I'm going to go ahead and get started. I'm going to try to keep this to 30 minutes, um, but welcome in. If you guys don't know who I am, my name is Keely Martinez. I'm a presidential diamond leader within doTERRA, and I have been using doTERRA essential oils for six years this month. Um, and I am obviously obsessed with these oils, but more so, I like to play. I like to play with these oils. I like to just experience them in maybe ways that are a little bit outside the box. So I'm going to start this off with a massive disclosure. <laughs> so number one, you do you boo. If you want to put oils where I'm telling you that I put oils, then great. If not, I'm not judging you. <laughs> I hope you're not judging me. Number two, dilution is always going to be your friend when it comes to using oils in more sensitive areas, okay? So always almost over dilute because you can always add in more essential oil, but I will tell you, tingling can turn into burning real quick <laughs> and that can get uncomfortable. So I just wanna make sure that you guys know that with every combination that I'm using with all the little recommendations, that you are grabbing some type of carrier oil. I personally love fractionated coconut oil. It is on the little bundle that Oil Life has linked into the chat. Um, I either use their coconut oil or doTERRA's coconut oil. So that is what I wanna make sure that you walk away from this is knowing that dilution is not going to make this any less effective and you can always add more essential oils, okay? Um, number three is essential oils and protection do not mix. So if in nine months you have a little surprise on your hands, do not blame me. It's not my fault. <laughs> I have warned you. Disclaimer is out there. Although the name Keely is pretty cute. So we will move forward. Um, I have created a little ebook for you guys that I have put up on OneDrop, OneDropDesigns.com. So if you guys are not familiar with OneDrop, it's just a digital media platform that has incredible content for your social media, your team, uh, yourself, your users, all the things. But I will link in the Oils and Intimacy ebook. It is free to our subscribers. Um, so if you want to get all my notes written out, I have them for you over on OneDrop, okay? So, um, okay. And this recording, also this class is getting recorded. You will get an email with it. So I know that will be another question that is asked is, can I get this in a recording? So you'll have full access to it, okay? So let's first start off when we're talking about intimacy. And again, there's really no judgment, whether it's intimacy with yourself, your partner, whoever, we have to talk about you feeling your best because we all know when you are looking your best, whether it's in a certain outfit, whether it is just after you work out, whether it is um, at a certain time of day, when you feel your best, you feel attractive, you feel sexy, you feel desirable, right? And so there are key things that I do to make sure that I'm always feeling like that to keep my intimacy um, on point. Number one is you're taking your supplements. Um, and obviously you're here for doTERRA. So you're taking your lifelong vitality supplements. There is nothing that will shift your energy faster than supplementing your body with the nutrients that it needs. If you are not getting what it needs, you feel sluggish, you feel foggy, you feel tired. And 
I don't know about you, but <laughs> eight o'clock hits and you're like, no, I'm tired. I want to go to bed. Right? So make sure you are supplementing your body. Now I will tell you guys, I take a full dose of the lifelong vitality supplements because energetically I feel a huge difference between a half dose to a full dose. So full dose of lifelong vitality, drinking your water, make sure you're drinking half of your body weight in ounces a day. This is a non-negotiable. Truly, it'll shift everything. It'll shift the way your skin looks, the way your hair looks, your energy levels, your hunger levels. And I don't know about you, but anytime you're feeling like bloated or a little bit overweight, like that's probably the first hard stop to wanting to be intimate, right? So drink the water, detox your body, put some lemon, some grapefruit, some type of citrus oil in your water to help to detox your body, okay? Number three, move your buns, move your butt, <laughs> get off the couch, move. Now I look at, at quote unquote working out as movement because it's not, I'm not working out to quote unquote punish myself. I'm moving my body because I have a body that is capable of moving. Okay. So you are moving your body. You are exercising, whether it is just going out for a walk, whether it is hitting the gym, whether it is taking a class whether it is swimming, whatever, whether it's like outside playing with your kids, you are moving your body for at least 30 minutes a day. And no, you don't need a day off. Just move your body. I promise you, you will feel better. Your confidence will be higher. You will feel more energetic. And there's nothing that will kill your intimacy life faster than having low energy. Okay. Other supplements you can use is Mito2 Max. So if really like you feel like you're in a fog, if you feel like your energy just sucks. I mean, let's, I have three kids just so you know, I have a six year old, a four year old and a two year old. So I know what it feels like to go through that first kind of postpartum phase, having the new baby, not sleeping at night, or maybe you just sleep like shit. No, oh, sorry. Sleep poorly <laughs> at night anyways. So if you sleep bad, then you want to look at making sure that you're, you're actually getting some good rest and you're getting some good energy boost throughout the day. So Mito2 Max first thing in the morning, like literally on an empty stomach, just try it. And then at night, take your Serenity and your Adaptive Soft Gels. Those two combined, I put in Kapaiba Soft Gels. Like I take all three every single night, sleep like a baby, okay? Um, key thing, take them after this class, after, after you play with these things, do not take them before because there's nothing worse than feeling exhausted when you're trying to play, okay? So those are my key things. So that is my foundation. I just want you guys to know that, that that's where I start off every day with. Okay. So first thing is first a happy headspace. I don't know about you, but 95% of the time surrendering, allowing yourself to feel things, um, is in your head. So especially for us as women, which I'm going to assume probably 90 to 95% of the people on this uh, class are women. We tend to get in our head about all the things like give me a head nod. If you're like, yeah, I know exactly what you're talking about. Like <laughs> you're trying to, trying to get frisky, but you're like, shit, did I turn that on? Did I, did I do that today? You're like going through your to-do list and <laughs> your poor partner is probably like they're trying, right? They're trying all the things, but you're in your head. So Happy headspace, you guys. This is the combination that I use. I take Clary Sage, Ylang Ylang, and Adaptive, and sometimes Neroli. So I'll say that again. Clary Sage, Ylang Ylang, Adaptive, and Neroli. And all I do is I literally put them all in my hand. So I use the Neroli Touch. It only comes in a touch. So I'll do the Neroli first, and then I'll do a drop of Clary Sage, a drop of Ylang Ylang, and a drop of Adaptive. Rub my hands together. And I literally massage it up your neck. So again, I'm kind of trying to get it near my head. So and near my nose so I can smell the aroma to help myself relax. Now you have to consciously tell yourself to relax and to surrender and to be present in the moment. Okay. So this is, that's going to help to clear out your headspace, clear out the fog, allow you to be present in the moment. Um, another thing is an emotional connection with your partner right? So to get a deeper emotional connection sometimes, and I'll be honest with you guys, sometimes even me and my husband, we're, we're kind of like ships <laughs> sailing in the night because he's going and doing one thing. I'm doing another thing. We have kids. We have all these things, all these moving pieces. And so if you don't feel emotionally connected to your partner, a really good combination. And this is actually, I have my husband apply these up and down my spine. Um, there's a piece of that that allows me to connect with him 
but it also allows him to understand that I'm trying to emotionally connect with him too. Okay. So I take rose touch, passion touch, neroli touch up and down my spine. Again, rose touch, passion touch, neroli touch up and down my, up and down my spine. And then I just do like an X over my chest. So again, it's just a physical connection. So if you're looking to emotionally connect with somebody, that, those, that's a really good combination. Okay, let's get into a little bit more down and dirty stuff. <laughs> um, so a tingling sensation. This is a incredible combination to use. Um, if you're looking for a warming and cooling effect, now there's a lot of lubrications out there that have a ton of chemicals, like hormone disrupting chemicals that you don't want to be putting in your lady bits, okay? So this will give you a very similar sensation for you and for your partner. So you're gonna do five drops of peppermint, five drops of cinnamon bark, three drops of ginger, and you're gonna get a, um, a two ounce, so we use this, a dropper bottle. So this is also linked in the Oil Life um, kit that they posted in the chat, but Oil Life sells. These are just little dropper bottles. These are two ounce bottles, and you're going to put your oils in here, fill the rest up with fractionated coconut oil. So you can see how heavily diluted this is, okay? So you're just going to swirl it around, and then you're just going to use the actual dropper top itself and drip it all over. <laughs> So the, the amazing thing about this is that you can add more, you can do less, you can add more coconut oil if you want. Um, if you're looking for kind of the next level of tingling sensation, a drop of Slim and Sassy, um, it's Smurr and Sassy up in Canada, but a drop of Slim and Sassy on your tongue will take it to the next level or a drop of Slim and Sassy on your inner thighs. We'll take it to the next level, okay? Um, how many drops of each? Five drops peppermint, five drops cinnamon bark, three drops ginger. Okay, all right, now we're gonna get real awkward. <laughs> now we're gonna talk about um, a wrinkle-free partner. <clears throat> so this is for my ladies on here who have a male counterpart. And Immortelle is great for wrinkles on your face, it's also great for wrinkles all over the body. So in your palm, you're going to take Immortel, roll it around. Now keep in mind, Immortel is not diluted at all. Um, it's one of the roller balls that is not a touch, so it doesn't have any type of coconut oil in it. So if you'd like to put a couple drops of coconut oil in your palm first and then do your Immortel on top of it. Um, or instead of coconut oil, we now have the new Yarrow Palm Body Renewal. Ladies, it is wonderful for firming your body and also firming all parts of the body. So we do Immortel in the palm, a couple pumps of Yarrow Palm Body Renewal. You rub your hands together, you rub vigorously on your partner, and you're welcome. And it is safe for internal use, okay? Um, and it also smells incredible and also gives you a little bit of a tingling sensation. Um, so yeah, is this awkward? Just for me. <laughs> just for me. Okay. We're good. Okay. Okay. So, um, uh, oil life is like, we are never having her teach again. <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> okay. So getting a little bit into some blends that I played with and that I personally love, um, activate her Aphrodite is one that you can actually put into a roller bottle. So I, again, I have all these typed out. There's kind of a few of them and I don't want to be repetitive on here, but I have them all typed out for you guys. So you're going to do bergamot, one drop of bergamot, two drops clary sage, two drops geranium, which you guys, I have to tell you, like I hate geranium, truly. Um, <laughs> Just the oil alone is not my favorite, but in these blends, I love it. Like it, there's, there's such a minute amount in these blends. So if you're thinking geranium and you're like me and you're like, oh no, hard pass on that. It really actually plays into the blend. Okay. So two drops geranium, two drops patchouli. And some people feel the same way about patchouli, but I promise you it makes a big difference in this blend. 
So two drops patchouli, two drops sandalwood, and four drops yelling yelling. I'll say that one more time. One bergamot, two clary sage, two geranium, two patchouli, two sandalwood. I use Hawaiian sandalwood, by the way. I just think it, my body responds to it better. Um, and four drops of yelling yelling. Okay. Okay. So you're going to combine all of those. And actually what I do is I have a five ML roller that I put those in. So if you're going to do a 10 ML roller, double that. Okay. Um, and what you're going to do is you're going to apply that down your neck. Now this is if like your libido is just a little bit low as a woman. Um, this helps to kind of pull out all of the femme energy into your body and really center yourself into your feminine energy. Okay. Especially if you're, so I'm an Enneagram type three, I'm an activator. I tend to tap into my masculine energy a lot. And so when I want to tap into my more feminine energy, this is a really good blend to tap into. Okay. Okay. Um, ecstasy extender. So this one, this combo works awesome. I will tell you guys. So if you're you or your partner, tend to get excited very quickly whenever you're intimate. This is a great option to grab. Um, so again, you're gonna take your two ounce glass dropper bottle like this. Um, you are going to do one to two drops of each of these oils, okay? Cinnamon, geranium, ginger, peppermint, and pink pepper. You get that? Cinnamon, geranium, ginger, peppermint, pink pepper. You're going to fill up the rest with fractionated coconut oil. And so you want to apply this about 15 minutes prior to interaction. Okay. So this really does help to extend your session. <laughs> I feel like this is really compliant. I'm really proud of myself, actually. <laughs> um, okay, that truly works though. I'll tell you guys that. Okay, so let's talk about the guys. Let's talk about getting, maybe it's your, your guy who can't keep up with you. I know quite a few of us little tigerists out there might have a guy who just is not as, you know, wanting to play as much as you are. So this is a combination. It's called Let's Get It On, the men's formula. And you're gonna do two drops clary sage, two drops wild orange, four drops yelling yelling, six drops sandalwood. Now this one you can actually diffuse. So like <laughs> this is probably one of the best ways to like unsuspectingly <laughs> approach it. You can throw all these in a diffuser. Um, or you can apply to his pressure points. So a really easy way is to say, hey, let me give you a massage, babe. <laughs> Super easy. Um, so, but those combinations, especially sandalwood, there's something in sandalwood that definitely helps to entice the sex drive, okay? Um, next one is called body warmer. So this is, um, oh, repeat that one. Sorry, I'm just looking over here. Okay, the let's get it on is two drops clary sage, two drops wild orange, four drops yelling yelling, six drops sandalwood. You're going to combine all the oils and then you can apply two pressure points or you can diffuse. Or you can swipe on the back of his neck as you are giving him a hug. Or you can just try to apply it anywhere on his body, really. I mean, truly at the end of the day, if you're getting these oils onto the body, you will see some type of result. Okay. Um, can I use Kanaga instead of Ylang Ylang? They have similar properties. Ylang Ylang is probably one of the most popular oils in this genre, just to let you guys know. So if this is an area where you're like, I, I want to either increase my own libido or my spouse's or my partner's libido, or I'm looking to feel a little bit more enticed or enticing either way, um, Ylang Ylang is probably one of the most common used oils in this genre, okay? Um, and you'll mix that, the let's get it on. You, you can make a roller bottle if you want, but I would actually pop it into a diffuser, personally. 
um, or you can try to apply topically too. Okay, the next one is a body warmer. So if this one would be good for a massage, um, two drops rose. Now I know most people don't have true rose because it's expensive, but you can pop the top off of your rose touch. Um, I don't know if you guys know this little trick or not. Let me see if I have a rose right here. So, okay, your rose touch. These toppers are really easy to pop off. So you can either like wiggle it out or you can even take your top of your roller bottle. And if you just, do you guys see how it like kind of kinked it out? So if you just lean the top out of your roller, you can wiggle it out and then it's open. So if you have a rose touch, you can do this and then you can take um, like a dropper top or you can just drip a couple drops into your hand if you have just a touch. So two drops rose, two drops ylang ylang, three drops clary sage, three drops sandalwood. Are you guys seeing a common theme with oils? You see that a lot of these are ylang ylang, clary sage, sandalwood, some type of floral oil, okay? So in the body warmer, um, you're gonna take a two ounce glass dropper. Again, this is why I link these in from Oil Life because these A, make your oils last a, long, a lot longer. They also make it easier to dilute these oils, especially when you're using them in sensitive areas. And it also makes it really easy. This is an easy massage oil to like take this out and to just drip it down my husband's back or to drip it anywhere on his body. This makes it super easy to know how much I'm putting on his body. Okay. So, um, okay. So the body warmer again, two drops rose, two drops ylang ylang, three drops clary sage, three drops sandalwood. You're going to combine it in a two ounce glass dropper bottle and you're going to use it as a massage oil. Um, to massage any area that you want to warm up. Okay. Um, an edible <laughs> massage. So this is your thing. <laughs> we can be friends, but an edible massage is you're actually going to take organic coconut oil. So fractionated coconut oil, you don't necessarily want to be ingesting it. You, um, I just use the coconut oil that we cook with, you know, we buy it from Trader Joe's, but it's like the hard white coconut oil. So you do about half a cup of that. And I put in two to three to four drops of, I like grapefruit and spearmint. Um, and that just makes a really fun massage paste-ish that like turns to liquid. If you've ever touched normal coconut oil or normal coconut oil, you know that it like turns to liquid as soon as it gets warm. So, but spearmint and grapefruit are amazing. Uh, wild orange and peppermint are also amazing. So again, we're thinking about the way things taste when we're <laughs> talking about an edible massage and you're using your hands and you're also using maybe your mouth and we're going to end this conversation there because it's awkward. Okay. Okay. Next one. And last one for these blends is it's called the mood maker. And this is really for anyone who just really struggles with getting in the mood, really struggles with maybe you, you run just a really busy life. You run your doTERRA business. You have a normal job. You have kids. You have all the things going in all the different places. And so you find it really, really difficult to feel sensual and intimate at the end of the day. Um, and you're wanting that you're wanting that connection with your partner or your spouse. Okay. So, um, this is actually a diffuser blend. So it's going to be one drop each cinnamon patchouli, rosemary, sandalwood, Siberian fir, and ylang ylang. I'll say those one more time. Cinnamon, patchouli, rosemary, sandalwood, Siberian fir, and ylang ylang. Literally just start diffusing that like as you're winding down for the, for the night. That one's called mood maker. Okay, guys, I have two more for you. Now, this next one is called the big O. Conveniently, the O with a dash over like doTERRA, which I'm sure that's not what they thought with their branding, but you know, when in Rome. So to prolong and stimulate, um, maybe just making it a little bit more of a deeper experience than like a surface experience. Are you guys with me? Can I get a head nod if you're with me? Okay. <laughs> um, you are going to use sandalwood, jasmine, and ylang ylang. Sandalwood, jasmine, ylang ylang. So 
I, I use Jasmine Touch. I it, anytime I have a touch, I just <laughs> I just apply it on my hand, and then I drip the oils on top of it. So a drop of sandalwood, a drop of yelling yelling. Um, I love using the touch oils because they're already diluted, so I already know that they're going to be safe for my skin, especially in sensitive areas. Um, but that applied where you experience pleasure where he experiences pleasure um, is going to literally make your toes curl. <laughs> okay, you're welcome. Okay, last but not least is a libido boost. So if you are just looking to, again, tap into feeling more sensual, um, wanting to feel more turned on with life in general, and especially with your partner or your spouse, um, you're gonna take Jasmine Touch and you're gonna swipe it hip to hip and then you're gonna follow that with ylang ylang and wild orange combined and put that on your pulse point. So I just put it across my wrists, I put it on my neck, and I'll also put it on my hip bones. And that for me will spike me, um, spike my libido, my desire. So that is um, your little libido boost. Now in here, I put a whole list of all the oils that I've kind of listed throughout this. So again, all this is all linked. Somebody put the link to the one drop download. It's free for all of our subscribers. If you're not a subscriber, you can go and check it out. But all of the oils to purchase are in there. Um, the last thing I want to tell you guys about is products to purchase. So the Yarrow Calm body serum makes an incredible lubrication. Incredible. Like hands down one of my favorites. Um, it has a coffee extract in it, which is firming to the body. Um, it, the, the carrier oils in there are so supportive to your skin too. Um, and then the other little tip is the beautiful body spray. So oddly enough, the beautiful body spray smells delicious, tastes delicious. So that's another little tip and trick that I actually got that from the Golden Platinum group. So who's ever a Golden Platinum in here, I bow down to you guys because you guys have some awesome tips. But um, the Beautiful Body Spray is another great one to play with in the bedroom. So per disclosure, I'm going to end again with this. Please properly dilute these. Please don't call doTERRA saying, Keely told me to use this on my lady bits and now it's burning use some type of dilution, use some type of common sense. If you're not comfortable with putting things internally, especially not in just in your mouth, but other places, do what you're comfortable with. You can diffuse any of these blends. You can use them topically, you know, down the spine, on the body. Um, always opt for a less is more because truly it is when it comes to this type of play. And outside of that, just have fun with it. You guys, these, I mean, there are so many things on the market right now that are marketed for this as lubricants or, you know, different things that have so many toxins in them that this is an easy way. If you're needing a little bit of some support in this area, or you just like to play like I do, that this is a really easy way to turn to your oils and to use things that are not only going to support your body, but feel good. All right, guys, what is the beautiful body spray? Go into your back office, into doTERRA.com. It's under the uh, body products. <laughs> Megan said the beautiful blend does taste good, surprisingly. It's good. Um, my oil life coupon code is EOKM5. So it's just like essentially obsessed Keely Martinez 5. That'll give you guys $5 off anything you purchase through oil life. And if you have not subscribed over to One Drop Designs yet, we do have a 20% off coupon code if you are a brand new subscriber. Whether you do a monthly, you know, one month plan or a full year plan, just type in the code 20% and write out the word percent. So 20%. That'll give you 20% off. But this whole ebook is over there and free, free for our subscribers. I just wanted to put everything in a place where you didn't have to write this down, search for it. And this would be a really good class too. If you're teaching about essential oils, this would be a really fun class to download this ebook and go and teach, go and connect with your community. Cool. Um, yeah, I think that is. 
the one drop app the one drop one drop is not an app one drop is a website so one drop designs.com it's a website so it's just a digital media website that i created um i co-founded so yeah it's awesome especially if you're doing social media or you're sharing online or you have a community it just is like a massive library of all doTERRA stock items graphics photos tools resources tons of stuff cool all right guys thanks for hanging out with me i sure love you guys we had almost 1700 people register for this class so Thank you for being live with me. If you're catching the recording, thank you for hanging out with me. I hope this was just as awkward for you as it was for me. And outside of that, I will catch you guys all later. Okay. Mwah. See ya.